Hey, Holton High School, class of 2020, it's Mr. Tweedy here. Um, I wanted to reach out for two reasons. One, I wanted to congratulate all of you. You did it. You made it this far. Congratulations. You are graduating this week. It's a big deal, um, so please make sure that you celebrate that appropriately. Secondly, though, I wanted to tell you guys you know, how badly I feel about everything that you've missed out on this spring. And so um, I recruited a little bit of help to do that. I was having a tough time putting things into words, and so I asked for some help. I hope you enjoy this. Hello, Holton High School, class of 2020. <laughs> yeah, surprise! You, you didn't know, you, I got you, didn't I? I surprised the heck out of you. Hi everyone, it's Bill Green. Hi guys, I just wanted to say a big congratulations from your principal and from me to the Holton High School class of 2020 on your graduation. Hello, this is Dan Ochara from Boston Bruins, and I would like to congratulate uh, Holton High School class of uh, 2020 to their graduation. Hi, this is Senator Angus King, and I want to join in congratulating the Holton High class of 2020. Hello, everyone. My name is Steve Clifford. I'm the head coach of the Orlando Magic. What's up, Holton High School class of 2020? It's Chum Lee here. Hey, what's up, my nerds? What has two thumbs and loves the Holton High School class of 2020? This guy! Hey, Holton High School class of 2020. This is Amy Vashon from the University of Maine Women's Basketball Program. Hi, this is Jerry Remy of the Boston Red Sox and Nesson, and this message for, is for the Holton High School graduating class of 2020. Greetings to the 2020 graduating class of Holton High School. What's up, Holton High School? It's Derek Rivers with the New England Patriots. Hey, what up? What up, uh, Holton High School class of 2020? It's Maddie Carteropel, aka Keith from Stranger Things. Hi, congratulations, 2020 graduates. I'm Billie Jean King. Hi there, Tim Sample here with a message from the Holton High School class of 2020. Warm greetings to you all from Bethesda, Maryland. My name is Tony Fauci and I'm a physician, medical researcher, and director of the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases at the National Institutes of Health. Hi, Holton High School, class of 2020. This is Sam Mewis from the U.S. Women's National Team and the North Carolina Courage. Greetings, class of 2020. Luke Cleal coming to you from his socially distanced kitchen in New York. I just wanted to say congratulations on such a wonderful achievement Job well done, you made it. This is Senator Susan Collins, and I'm delighted to congratulate the Holton High School class of 2020. You did it. What is going on? This is David Henry, aka Justin Russo, and I've been speaking to Mr. Tweedy. Okay, Mr. Tweedy and I want you to know that we are very, very proud of you, all of you students at Holton High School class of 2020. Hi, this is Ron Renneke. On behalf of the Boston Red Sox, we'd like to congratulate the class of 2020. I was actually born in Island Falls, went to elementary school in both Mattawamkeg and Lincoln, college at Maine Farmington, uh, and then my first head coaching job was at Woodland High School, so I've been to Holton many, many times. Sky rockets in flight, boo! Class of Holton High, whoop! On behalf of the people of the state of Maine, I congratulate you on achieving this accomplishment. Uh, Mr. Tweedy, Principal Tweedy, your principal, asked me to send you guys a message. Now I understand you are graduating this week. Nice, congratulations. And let's face it, some of you never thought that you would graduate, but you did it, yes. You graduated high school, trust me, it's important. And you did it, so that's great. I just wanted to take a second and congratulate you all on graduating from high school. It's a great accomplishment and a very special time in your lives. You are all graduating. Congratulations to each and every one of you. And I just want to congratulate you guys and wish you good luck. Moving on to the future and despite the coronavirus, we're going to keep pushing forward. Um, I know this is tough times and um, not certain what's going on. I want you to know that we're all with you. We're all proud of your accomplishments 
and we can't wait for all the great things the class of 2020 will bring to our world. It's a shame that we're going through this coronavirus thing right now and you can't really celebrate the way you normally would for a graduation, but you all should be very proud of yourself for what you've accomplished and, and well wishes for the future. A memorable year for sure and a tough year. Hey gang, um, I know, uh, listen, I miss your scent. You missed your prom. You missed your class trip. You missed your spring activities. Missing graduation. I am profoundly aware that graduating during this time and virtually without your friends, classmates, and teachers close by is extremely disappointing at best. It's been a tough few months on everyone. And you seniors, we know you've had to miss a lot. You've had to make a lot of adjustments, but you've continued to work hard and to graduate. You've had to find new ways to carry on long-standing traditions that previous classes in your positions took for granted. And so I'd like to thank you for having done your part to help us in the public health community get our hands around what's going on with this epidemic. Please hang in there. We need you to be smart, strong, and resilient. With discipline and empathy, we will all get through this together. I know you didn't necessarily get to have a party you might have wanted, but um, we'll all look back at this time, and I hope we can look back at this time and, and uh, try to get some positive out of it, some good out of it. Hopefully we're spending more time with our families, more time with our friends. Our priorities are being put into perspective. You know, there's an old conundrum. If a tree falls in the forest and there's nobody there to hear it, it doesn't make a sound. Well, that's a little above my pay grade, but how about this one? If a class graduates from Holton High School in 2020 and there's not a big crowd in the auditorium, is it still a wicked big deal? Oh, I know the answer to that one. Yeah, 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 it sure is. Um, I know that you're not going to be able to have your traditional Holton High School gymnasium, sweaty June, pop and circumstance, in-person graduation ceremony like, you know, everybody else since the beginning of time. But don't let that reality diminish the fact that you have done something really amazing, really incredible, and really long-lasting for your lives. Well, this may not be the celebration that you envisioned and deserve. This accommodation to the great challenge we face does not in any way diminish your tremendous accomplishments. You are the future of tomorrow. <laughs> I know that sounds super cheesy, but I just wish you all so much luck moving forward and can't wait to see you guys do some amazing things. Each and every one of you have had an experience that will prepare you for the future. An experience that no graduating class in the past 102 years has ever had. Class of 2020 is even more famous because of the pandemic. And now you, who are young and energetic and full of intelligence and spirit, are armed with the power. And that power is the knowledge that nothing in life is guaranteed. The class of 2020 will always be recognized as the class that managed to graduate in the middle of a pandemic. If you can do that, you can accomplish anything. As a native of the county myself, I know firsthand the spirit that brought educators, parents, friends, and neighbors together to provide you with a great education. That's a lot of early mornings and test taking and homework and studying and substitute teachers and getting up at three in the morning to finish that term paper that you should have done a month ago. Yeah. Never stop learning and never stop learning how to learn. Each and every one of you can now say, you are as smart as me. Nice. And remember, if you ever have any question, particularly in math, just give me a call because I do the numbers. Holton High School has prepared you well for the adventures that lie ahead. Who knows what that may be, going to college, going into the service, uh, getting a job. 
You congrats on guys going to college, folks going on to military places or wherever you're going. I hope you'll take with you from this school the desire to question and to continue to learn no matter your next steps in life. Today you've opened up your options. Whatever job you end up in, whatever path you take, you'll always have the ability to challenge and to think and be informed, to question your own views and those of others. Um, I wish you luck in all of your future endeavors and I encourage you to work hard and achieve your dreams. I wish you nothing but the best moving forward. I know you all will go on to do amazing things and uh, I'm excited to see um, how you impact this world. And enjoy this time as much as you possibly can. Remember, moving forward, always chase your dreams. Don't let any go past. Relationships are everything. The relationship with yourself, with your faith, with your family, your friends, and all your loved ones. Work hard, be kind, and be your best self. Anyway, you did it, well done, and it's important, and I want you to take a minute and really celebrate that moment in your lives, because it counts. It's probably gonna be a little bit of a different celebration this year, but when this whole COVID-19 thing is passed, all right, Mr. Tweedy, mm, he didn't really tell this, but. I'm going to speak for him. This summer, I want you all to get together. And you know what I want you to do? I want you to party. Yeah, with a big pot of chili. Because nothing says, I've graduated, like chili. Nice. And congratulations. You're off into a very interesting landscape in this brave new world, and I'm sure you'll excel at many things. So hopefully you're using this quiet time in your life to figure out what your future looks like now that you're graduated and really be focused. I'm gonna leave you with a few words from a poet of my generation, Bobby Dylan. And it goes like this, part of it does. May you grow up to be righteous. May you grow up to be true. May you always know the truth and see the light surrounding you. May you always be courageous, stand upright and be strong. And may you stay forever young. Again, congratulations on this great accomplishment. I wish you all the best as you begin this next chapter in your life. We wish you a lot of success in your next adventures and be proud of your accomplishments. You've earned it. I hope you all are staying safe and healthy right now um, and good luck with everything. Congratulations on graduating. But congratulations, best wishes, and it's a pleasure to be able to join you, if only virtually. Um, just want to say congrats. Um, love you guys, praying for you guys as families. Um, congrats on graduating. I just wanted to say congratulations to the class of 2020 and best of luck. Congratulations. I wish you all a magical time post-graduation. So again, congratulations and best of luck in the future. Uh, all the best guys, congrats, and hopefully you guys can enjoy it uh, once you get to, together. So all the best and again, congrats. I wish you all the brightest of futures. I hope it all works out for you. Continue to work hard and uh, do as the cliche says, and that is, if you can find something that you love to do and get paid for it, that's what you should be doing with your lives. Enjoy it, enjoy the ride, and uh, I wish you all the very best. Take care. And so, congratulations, enjoy, and be well as you celebrate this wonderful milestone. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors. God bless you, and I really appreciate uh, uh, all of you for being fans. Congratulations. Yeah, take care. Bye-bye. You guys are amazing, and congratulations. All right, gang, peace and love. So, congratulations again, Holden. Congratulations, you guys. You will always be a son or daughter of Maine. If you leave, I wish you well. But when you come back, I'll be here to say, welcome home. So think about what you want and go out and get it. And wherever you go and whatever you do, I hope you remember, don't go bragging just because you're from Maine. And congratulations to the class of 2020. You guys got this. Take care.
Congratulations, seniors!